in today's video. I'll be showing you how to fix DirectX errors when trying to play Battlefield 2042. As you can see on my screen at the moment, I've got a DirectX function error and it caused my game to completely crash. So there are a few things that you can do to resolve this issue. So the first thing you need to do is just close down the message and once you close down the message, you now need to remove any overclock settings that you have applied to your graphics card, if you have. So once you have removed your overclock settings, go ahead and launch Battlefield 2042 again. If it didn't resolve the DirectX issues you're experiencing, then the next thing you need to do is ensure that you have the latest driver installed for your graphics card. This is really important when it comes to resolving issues with Battlefield 2042 crashing. Not only will it resolve hopefully the DirectX issues you're having, it will improve the performance and stability in Battlefield 2042 and can also help improve the FPS in game. So go ahead and download the latest driver for your graphics card and once you have installed the driver, open up Battlefield 2042 and see if that resolved the issue. I will pop links in the description below to where you can download the drivers for AMD, Nvidia and Intel graphics cards. If updating your graphics card didn't resolve the issue, then the next thing you need to do is ensure Windows is up to date. I will be showing you how to do this in Windows 10, but it's very similar in Windows 11. So we need to right click on the start menu icon, click on settings, and you now need to click on to update and security and you just want to click on check for updates and ensure that you have the latest updates installed. If Windows does detect any new updates then it will install those updates and then once they have been installed restart your computer, launch Battlefield and see if that helped fix the issues. If that didn't then the next thing you need to do is click on the link that's in the description below and you will end up on a page that looks like this. You now need to select your language and then click on download and you then need to go save file and once the file has downloaded you now need to run the setup file. You then need to agree to the terms if you do agree click I accept and then go next and if you want to install the Bing bar then keep this option here ticked I don't want to. So we can now go ahead and press next and it will now search see if it can detect any new DirectX updates available for your computer. And as you can see, I do have the latest DirectX version installed, which is absolutely fantastic. Also, it's important to ensure Windows is up to date because Windows 10 and 11 do update DirectX through the check for updates also. So you want to always ensure you have the latest updates installed for Windows. So once you have done all that, go ahead and launch Battlefield again if it did detect a new DirectX version and then see if that fixed the issue. If it didn't, then the next thing you need to do is just ensure you don't have anything open when you're launching Battlefield 2042. So on my computer, the reason I got the DirectX error was because I had Discord open. And every time I had Discord open, I would then receive that error message. As soon as I closed down Discord, I did not experience another DirectX function error. So if you're using Discord or any other program like that, even an overlay program, so like OBS, Rivia Tuner and stuff like that, close it all down, launch the game and see if that resolves the issue. If it didn't, then the next thing you need to do is open up your documents folder. So once you've opened your documents folder, you now need to go into the Battlefield 2042 folder and you then need to go into settings. And you now need to right click on this file here that says prof save underline profile and you then need to click on open with. You now need to open it up with notepad and you then need to go control and F on your keyboard and you then need to type in DX12 and then go find next. You will now have a line that says GST render dot DX12 enabled and it should say zero you need to change this value to one. And once you've done that, you then need to click on file and then save. Go ahead now and launch Battlefield 2042 and this will force the game to use DirectX 12. And hopefully that will resolve the DirectX issues you're having with Battlefield 2042. If that didn't fix the issue, then the next thing you need to do is open up Origin. And once Origin's open, you now need to select your game library and you then need to find Battlefield 2042 and you need to right click on the game. You now need to select repair and it will now begin to check 
all the files for Battlefield 2042 and if it does detect an issue with one of the files, say if it's become corrupted or missing, then it will repair those files. And once it's finished, go ahead and launch Battlefield 2042 and with a bit of luck, that has resolved the issues you're having. And if that doesn't unfortunately resolve the DirectX issues you're having with Battlefield 2042, then the next thing I'd suggest is try reinstalling the game. I hope this video helped you out and you enjoyed it. If you did like the video, click the like button below and if you want to see more computer sluggish videos then hit that subscribe button and if you do subscribe I will see you in the next video.